TCU, what have you seen from the running game so far? Wow, speed, speed, speed. They got a combination of not only the uh, the small, quick guys, but they got a couple big backs, and, and all those guys can run. Uh, they have a way of, of bringing you in tight and try to pound you. They got a way of spreading it out and, and using those guys on the edge. So uh, we think we'll see a combination of things from them. Uh, we're trying to give our guys as, as, as many looks as we can without watering down what we're trying to do. And I think they've adapted well to it throughout the course of the week. But again, matching the speed and quickness of those guys uh, will be a definitely a bigger test than what we've seen in the first two weeks for sure. Okay, I guess what you saw on tape from the first game, was that a lot different than what you guys saw from tape from last year? Uh, they threw enough different things at you. You don't know what the game plan will be until they show up, but we, we have enough uh, game tape on them and it depends on what package they want to attack us in and whatever package they go to, we have to adjust and, and be ready to defend what they, they attack us with. And I think we've made a, a you know, our guys are aware that they're multiple in, in many ways, and we just have to match the personnel and, and try to go out and make our calls and see if we can execute. Okay. Do you think they're probably one of the more multiple offenses you'll kind of see in the Big 12 this year? They, uh, I think so. Uh, I think they're multiple from a personnel, but they also, from a skill set, speed, uh, the combination of athleticism and speed that they have at every position, you know, not looking ahead by any means. Uh, by far, this is the most talented team that we play, that's for sure. So it's hard to look ahead because, you know, this is the, the first look at these guys. But what they put on tape last week was very impressive for sure. 17 for 17 passing last week. <laughs> yeah. No, and when they play two quarterbacks, you know, uh, like they did, um, you know, uh, both are very talented. You know, the experience of, of the guys that are coming back, uh, you know, our guys are going to challenge them. You know, we're going to challenge them, and we're going to try to make them throw it in some tight windows. Uh, we'll have every opportunity to, to deflect and intercept the ball as he's throwing it, and, and our guys just got to be in the right position. Uh, get a little rush on these guys, hopefully up front, and, um, you know, we'll see what happens when the ball's in there. We saw Skyler out there a little bit more this week. I mean, what, do you have a long-term plan with him as far as this season goes? I mean, try to get. Do you want to give him more, or just kind of give him little bits? We, we're gonna give him what he can handle, and that's for sure. We want to make sure he's involved in the game plan. Know he's in the game plan. We put him in the game, and you know, two minute situations. In the, you know, we're going to play him, and when his when his series is up, we're going to play him. And uh, the kids, he's handled it. He's obviously recognizing the speed of the game is a lot more. Uh, than it is in high school, but, but Scott, you know, he's he's how he's in the practice. Uh, there's just some things that happen a little bit faster to him that he has to diagnose and, and key a little bit better. Uh, but he's a, he's in every every game plan that we we put together each week. So. Any fear of losing him to the offense? Uh, you know, him scoring that touchdown, <laughs> I had to bring him back down to earth a little bit. Uh, but but it was nice to see that all the guys were teasing him after the score. Uh, you know, coach is going to use him. He's, he's versatile that way. He was that way in high school, and that's one thing about Coach Weiss. He's going to use every uh, arsenal uh, that he has, uh, no matter if it's on the offense or defensive side of the ball. So uh, that's one thing about Coach Weiss. I like he's going to scheme to win, and I love that.